cutting board holder. Now, it includes the UV knife block body, three cutting boards, the removable power cord, and of course, a user instruction booklet. It helps to sanitize and dry your kitchen tools by exposing cutting boards, knives, and scissors to UV for 30 minutes. By doing this, you're killing 99% of bacteria like E. coli. The air drying function goes strong for 60 minutes to remove any water or residue. No more air drying required. And you can also use it for knives, a pair of scissors. The choice is yours. Choose the mode that suits you best. You can order my UV knife block and cutting board holder right now. And of course, you can always watch a full presentation at hsn.com. Cheers, guys. Stacey, everybody, my name is Guy. Gigi, we streaming live on Facebook? Gigi, are we streaming live on Facebook? She's got the tablet. Hi, Facebook friends, love you guys. Everything in the hour is free shipping and handling, you know, uh, so if you are getting ready, I wore red, because Valentine's Day is like, what, like almost two weeks, right? So you can order stuff now and get it for Valentine's Day. That's fantastic. And man, I got a great show. We've got lots of great stuff. We got some sweet, we got some savory. We got some sugar-free stuff. We got some stuff with sugar. So we got something for everybody. Let's take a look at the special board that we got over here. So I got all kinds of great stuff on the board today. We got sweets, we got treats. Uh, we've got uh, the peanut butter cups, the, the keto peanut butter cups coming up in a little bit. We've got David's cookies. We've got the love cake. The love cake, have you seen that beautiful cake? It's gorgeous. Red velvet, my favorite. That's coming up in a little bit. Um, I've got miracle noodles. So let me tell you, those noodles are ridiculous. They're over here. How many of you love pad thai? right? You love the stir fries, you like the noodles. Well, rice noodles are full of carbs. These don't have any, all right? These are amazing. They are keto-friendly noodles. I, I'm going on auto ship today. They just told me that they're going to start auto ship on this, so I'm going on auto ship. I like the peanut. It comes in either teriyaki or the peanut sauce. This stuff is so good. I'm telling you, I made it last night for dinner. I, I went and got chicken. I got, I got satay from the, from the um, sushi place. I broke it up, I, I added, added stir-fried vegetables. It tasted just like the pad thai at the restaurant, but without the carbs, all right? Amazing. Everybody gets a six pack of those for $34.99. I'm signing up for auto ship today. You, you have to try those. Pat, we still have both flavors, right? Peanut, and then we also have teriyaki. I've tried them both, they're both delicious. That is coming up in a little bit as well. Lots of fun, and we've got shortbread cookies, which I can't wait. Deb Marie's here, and she's got great, great little biscuits. They're so cute, all Valentine themed. So stick around for that. All right, where do you want me to squeeze in? Right here? Carrie Maletto. Carrie Maletto yeah. is, you are, you are like my co-star on Now That's Tasty. I love that. Carrie's been that's with me. us for years and, years and years and years. And let me tell you, I yeah. implicitly trust her taste buds when it comes to all things food. She she's, travels the world, you've been all over the place. And I will tell you, and I'll tell you guys this at home, I buy one brand of chocolate from HSN. That's right. It's red. Yeah. And the reason I buy red chocolate is because I cannot tell the difference between this and European regular full sugar milk chocolate. Yep. The difference is, is that this dreamy, creamy artisanal chocolate, which is made by European chocolatiers, by mm -hmm. the way, yes. okay, is guilt-free. Okay, all right, there's some calories, but because it's chocolate. But as far as the sugar, if you can't have sugar, yeah. right, in your diet, yep. or if sugar makes you crazy, yep. now sugar's where a lot of the calories come That's from. Right. Tell me, I'm, I'm, I may be mistaken, about 100 calories a bar. So 100 calories in your milk chocolate, only 80 calories in your dark 80. chocolate. And we have all your favorite flavors. And here's the best part. One bar, like I can eat half a bar and I'm good. Sure. It's very, very rich and satisfying yeah. and there is no weird aftertaste. You need to try it. We've got our brand new latest configuration. Okay, it's our, I think it's our weekly deal drop. It is. Yes. We dropped the price. Do you know it's under a dollar a bar? There's 24 bars. 24 bars. I'm going to let you go over, take over all well, the flavors and all that stuff. First things first, I always like to start here. The thing that we do special that most Look don't the is they're giving you an actual box for Valentine's Day. So it's coming with these two sleeves for Valentine's Day, which turns into your card. So you know I have to read the card. Guy, there is nothing better than a friend unless it's a friend with chocolate. Happy Valentine's oh, you're Love, so Red. Sweet. So you can write your own personal message inside. Yeah. And we all know that a card alone can be $3 up to $6 up right. to, I mean, they're expensive. 
them. Write your own personal message, okay? So that's where it starts. But then you have your full box here and you have another box. You're getting Get two, two boxes. boxes each with 12 bars in them. So you can use it as two gifts or you can go ahead and break it apart and have those 24 bars if you're in a workplace or a place where you want to share them. Now, let's get into the chocolate. Why red? Master Chocolatiers, years of experience going through to give you true European style chocolate. I want to start with milk chocolate. Yep. European style chocolate, but getting rid of all the guilt, getting rid of the reason why you had to say no to chocolate or why you continually say no to chocolate. This is keto friendly, Weight Watchers friendly. This is gluten free. Yeah, my husband's gluten free, so I have to watch out for that. But guess what? When you bite into this, no palm oils, the top of the line cocoa beans that we're using from the Cote d'Ivoire region, which is out of Africa, and that's where you get the best, best beans, chocolate. best yep. chocolate beans. Yep. So we're doing that for you. But you're getting those four pieces, and like Guy was saying, this is how I do it. I do like after breakfast, after lunch, yeah. after dinner. Bring, like, I mean, it's like throughout the you day, can bring you one, snack. One bar for work. Yeah. And I'm telling you, you take a bite whenever you need it and you're getting 24 bars. That's right. The flavors, I now, everybody knows and you know, my favorite, my favorite one is the blonde. Yes, uh, we're right? gonna get there in just a But it was always the milk chocolate because at really first cool. because the milk chocolate, yes. here's what it is. Milk when you eat yeah. poorly manufactured milk chocolate, and it can be full of sugar, you can, there's a film that gets on the inside of your mouth. It's, it's right. an oily texture when it's not been tempered properly. Master chocolatiers know how to make it so that it melts in your mouth. It's all about how they temper the chocolate. And that's what these guys do, which is yeah. the mouthfeel is half the thing with this. You put it in your mouth and it immediately starts to dissolve. That's right. And there is no... It's like Prettiness. sweetener aftertaste. No. Mm -mm. I, I actually think I felt like it had sugar in it. That's what it tasted like to me. Well, because that's the idea. Is, and that's why we worked one. so hard to get that perfect, perfect recipe. Also, mm. we wanted to give you something that was really... Do you know we eat with our eyes? And mm. I think a lot of times we, we may or may not realize that. Pretty. But the first thing is that it catches your eye. It's like a jewel. So I always say this is your moment of elegance. This is like jewelry for your mouth. You and that? I know it sounds crazy. And you crazy, see that sheen on the chocolate? you see it? That's what you're looking for. Yeah. You're not looking for a waxy texture and you don't want it to be if you get chocolate <clears throat> and it has like a grayish tint to it the oil is separated right. it wasn't made well that's right this is a solid color all the way through it has a little bit of a matte finish but even the texture the diamond okay. way that they did it that's right and look you're looking close at this one this is actually our dark chocolate with our spanish orange that's and so almond good. uh so the orange almond to me is like <clears throat> it is incredible explosion of flavor because you you've got that kind of um pop of the almond but then it's that juicy crispy mm. I, I don't even know how to explain it it's just like a really cool thing that happens with orange almond you're in the blonde already okay so your choices all milk chocolate all dark chocolate or half milk chocolate half milk chocolate with macadamia and hazelnut right or half all dark chocolate and half dark chocolate with the um, almond and orange or or go all blonde blonde Blondes have more fun, I say. That's, that's what they say. Um, I, you know, I was this, blonde for five years. <laughs> let me tell you what this tastes. Let me tell you what this tastes like. Yes. So, if you could put together caramel, toffee. Yes. Um, I, I, buttery. It has that buttery texture to it as well. I, I, it, it's just the most and and milk chocolate. So if you mix those yes. all together, right. right? I'm missing one. What's my other flavor? I always say. Um, uh, maybe caramel. Did you? Yeah, think I think that there I said caramel, caramel. But, but there's not. It's. It tastes like that though. It's unbelievable. And when I snap one, if you guys come in close, I want to snap one. I want to show you how clean. Do you see how that snaps? Boom. Yes. That is beautifully made chocolate. And look inside. You're not seeing any white. <clears throat> it is perfectly balanced. Thank you so much, Nicole. It's perfectly balanced. And the flavor, when you bite into this, I love that snap. It snaps, and then it melts. And then it breaks apart. Yeah. I can taste it through my nose. If you've never okay. tried this, go the blonde or the milk. I'm just telling you. Blonde is exclusive. Okay, so we need to talk about this second because what it is is it's milk from Holstein cows. It's, it's been toffee, whipped. Toffee. That so, was the other thing I wanted to say. And there's not toffee in it. It tastes like it's toffee. It's been whipped till it caramelizes. The milk Holy is whipped till it caramelizes, and then it is mm. mixed with our white mm. chocolate base. And that is how we you, blonde happened. Blonde is exclusive. You can't find it anywhere else. It's super special. So if you want something even more unique for your Valentine's Day gift, get the blonde because they'll be like, where did you get this? And it even when you, I do remember when you first tried this. Yeah. I was and shocked. when it was first sent to me, I was I didn't like, know it was sugar -free. I said, I said, Glenn, you know, who who, who runs uh, red chocolate, I said, so uh, there's like caramel in here, right? This is like a yeah. and he goes, no. And I go, what? 
<laughs> so it's like so crazy. So you will taste butterscotch, you'll taste, um, you know, caramel, a you'll coffee. taste all these things, a toffee. I'm telling you. It's just very <laughs> wonderfully milked, non -G uh, whipped non-GMO milk that is beautiful and delicious. And it's this the most high, oh my gosh. I'm, I actually have a milk chocolate and I have a little He's piece of the blog and everybody. I'm putting them together like this. Which by the way, You're if you so buy, smart. you can buy a couple of them and I'm gonna put this in my mouth. <laughs> and mix it up together. So, you know, listen, oh at, at this time of year, I, 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 you guys know me, I'm a foodie. I thoroughly enjoyed my holidays. My pants are tight. Everything's mm -hmm. the way it should be in January. But I go, okay, it's time to rein it back a little bit. I'm still going to enjoy my treats, okay? But, like, I love that I can still have this, and I don't have to have any guilt. I love that I can still have this. There's no sugar added. If you are a gluten-free person, if you are a person who's doing keto right now, or Weight Watchers, if you yeah. are a person you don't have who's to, just... You don't have to suffer. Watching your nutrition, okay? Yeah. These are so great because, again, no sugar added. You're looking at three grams of sugar in a full bar of milk chocolate and so that is really enabling you to give that's you crazy. back that moment of elegance and that's why it's for me chocolate is that <clears throat> I'm having a rough moment versus, a rough versus 18 to 20 grams of sugar in a regular exactly chocolate bar. I will just sit there and break this off yep. and just be like listen if you want sugar out. I got red velvet cake coming up in a little sure. bit and you can totally indulge yourself with that that's right what what we're trying to say is red velvet cake is not every day these you can have every day. Yep. And if you need that fix at two or three in the afternoon, you've got a chocolate bar and a go-to chocolate bar you can try. That dark chocolate and orange is crazy. And I'm not a dark chocolate fan, but I like that one a okay. lot. Okay, okay. I just, I'm I've always sure been a white chocolate guy, which is why I lean towards the blonde because I like, I like my, I like it a little. And more I think the, if you are a white chocolate yeah. person, yes, get the blonde. Yeah, get the blonde. Mm -hmm. But if you're a milk chocolate person, this milk chocolate will floor you. I'm, the first time you bite it, you're gonna literally look at whoever you're with and be like, I can't believe this doesn't have sugar in it. But let me tell you something. I just had the dark chocolate, and if you're a person who kind of like, I'm you always like milk chocolate because it felt like it was creamier, and then, you know, a lot of times dark chocolate can be very oh, gritty. The orange? We do it, yes, that's orange. We do an extra refinement process, so even I just had dark chocolate, and it's still coated, like it coated my mouth. This is how much is 24 bars, by the way. They're coming in these two cases. It's a lot. These are two rows in here of chocolates. This is a lot of candy bars. If you have been recently to the grocery store and you have that moment where you get to the, you know, cash register and you go, I'm going to get myself something. Have you seen how expensive each one of those are? And they are just chocolate you know from funny? wherever. You know what's funny? I always have a box of these like yeah. right next to my refrigerator. And That's it amazes smart. me how mm -hmm. many you get. You get 24 bulk. bulk. 24 bars. I mean, that's like what a store would buy, right? Yeah. To, to, to display, and you get them all at your house, and you can pack them in a lunchbox, give them to your kids. Little kids, don't even tell them there's no sugar in it. They won't know. Excuse, they're not going to know. They they're going to be like, oh my gosh, this is so good. Get them the blonde or get them the milk chocolate. I, by as a rule, I've never been a huge fan of dark chocolate. Yeah. You, that dark chocolate is different. Our dark chocolate is the bomb. I'm like, that you. is not so, it's not bitter. At all. At all, it's an extra refinement process, and you know. And one thing, I, here's one thing I want to share. Listen, at Valentine's, flowers say I'm sorry, but chocolate says I love you. So if you want to give somebody something and you want them to know you love them, you give them chocolate. But first, give yourself some chocolate. I always, you know, I always say that. Get one for yourself. <laughs> Just I mean, put them in places where you, you got, know you're going to need to snack. You have two Valentine's gifts. Oh, you have two. Yeah, you're of getting course. two boxes of these. Yep. And I can see by our counter, oh, close to 500. I've already been spoken for. This happens every time you bring it in. And by the way, I think that's the lowest price we've ever done. It's, it's I yeah. think it is the lowest yeah, price. Yeah, it's really good. Because I rarely have them for less than a dollar a piece. And it, <laughs> who's that? Somebody just must have eaten some chocolate. Then it's like, woo! -hoo. Um, <laughs> remember, would you just give them real quick the, the choices one more time so okay. they can get? So, all milk chocolate, 24 all milk. bars. Yep. All dark chocolate, 24 dark. bars. Or you can mix and match. You're going to do 12 of milk, 12 milk with macadamia and hazelnut. If so you that's want that. all milk again. Right? So you yep. get 12 of each. Or you're going to do 12 dark chocolate and 12 dark chocolate with orange Perfect. almond. So or it the gives blonde. You, or straight up all blonde. Pick up a blonde. I'm just Pick telling up. you. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'll have one. I haven't had this in a minute. All right. Is that it for you? Mm, yeah. I, I told you, you should be a co-host. You're on my show it all the time. It is so good. <laughs> I forgot. I hadn't heard Thank you, my friend. Enough. All right, Carrie, we'll be back probably next week. Yes. Hey, there's the red velvet cake. And let me just tell you, I got to get one of those, man. You know, let me tell you, there's nobody on this planet that loves red velvet cake more than me. I don't think. It's my favorite cake. I always ask her for my birthday. I just love it. It's a southern thing, I guess. And I'm not from the south, so maybe that's why I love it. 
So, uh, because I'm not from there and I, and I want it. $59.99, that cake will probably serve, what, eight, 10 people? Um, or two very hungry people. All right, we are gonna continue on. And we are gonna talk about my next item. Let me just get my cards back and shuffled the right way. This is from Delight Patisserie. And I will tell you, I'm, I'm brand new. First time to the show. I am so excited to try these. These are their Valentine's, what we're calling their Valentine's message cookies. Everybody will get a big box of these. There's 16 of the cookies inside. Uh, they're packed uh, in groups of four. And each one of these cookies has their own little love message. Remember the candy hearts when we were kids? These have little love messages. What a beautiful little gift. Look, be mine. You are terrific because you can use these with tea. Uh, we've got I love you or heart you to the moon and back. And then what's the last one say? Uh, I'll crumble for you. I'll crumble for you. All right. Deb Murray. Deb Murray is joining me uh, who is... I've known Deb for Hi. probably since ever I've, since I've been yeah. here. Yeah. So we go back at least 20, 25 exactly. years. Exactly. Deb is an all things expert in the kitchen, and I know one thing. I, I watch all your stuff on, on the internet. I love all your recipes, all that Thank stuff. Thank you. And she knows quality. And I, I have yet to try these. I said I'm going to wait till we get on air because I heard they're amazing. These are a shortbread cookie, correct? These are a shortbread cookie. Okay. The owner of the company, Celine, her okay. lifelong passion is pastry. She went to Paris, went and worked... And went and studied in one of the greatest culinary schools for pastry. There she is. She's so beautiful. So these. she got her degree in pastry. Oh. The moved to LA to live the American dream, and she created these beautiful little cookies. They are the exact same recipe that you would oh. have in the finest restaurants in Smell Paris. Like butter. They call them Paris tea biscuits, yeah. but it's just shortbread. It's just butter, sugar, vanilla. But then she has them hand stamped, so each one has a little love message on it. So it's like having a little edible love note, you know, instead of giving this for Valentine's Day, what says love more than butter, sugar, vanilla? I mean, isn't that beautiful? How about your after? taste on it. And I do want to correct you because what? most people don't realize what? even though there's four compartments, they come in packages of two. Oh, okay. So you can get That was confusing yes, on the yes, card because I was is. like, that, yes. that math doesn't add up. Precisely. So every, so there's eight packages of two. Correct. Gotcha. So okay. now, like, I could put these in my my grandchild's lunchbox. I could put this in your little packet. I was handing them out in the hall. Pat Wall, I gave him one. I'd crumble for him, Luke. I mean, they're just so beautiful. They're they're so delicious. They're made with the finest quality ingredients. Mm. If you love shortbread, you're going to love these. But the message just, it'll make your heart just feel so good inside. I've never seen message cookies. I never have. She, this <clears throat> is her business. This is her. Yeah. I mean, they sell them in the finest stores, the right. gourmet stores. The very this high set end. is absolutely yeah. exclusive to here to get the four messages on there. You might have seen her on the Good Morning shows or yeah. on The View. I mean, she's just well, delicious. And I've said this forever is that people make all kinds of cookies at home, but you rarely see people making their own shortbread. Precisely. <laughs> it's hard to make. Precisely. And it's hard to get it right. Mm -hmm. And that's why you some these people are, people who make these are people who have gone to culinary school, all right? Precisely. <clears throat> it's almost like people that are bread makers. You really exactly. got to know what to you're doing. To get the fine layers To get that, yeah, and to get that crisp because, you know, they, the, way mm. they, the way they laminate the dough and they add all the butter and all that great stuff inside. Mm. I love a shortbread cookie because when I, a shortbread cookie is something you can al almost breathe in. Precisely. You know when you put it in your mouth mm. and that butter kind of comes up through your nose? And I love... I love the texture of shortbread because yes. it's, it's crisp, but then it just dissolves. Dissolves. You can feel the butter, yeah. the layers. I mean, yeah. it's just so beautiful. And again, things like this, you could, like when you, have you ever gone to Paris? Yes. I adore Paris. And my favorite thing to do in I Paris is I could live there if I could speak the uh, language a little bit better. I, I've gotten okay with, with it. With Google Translator, you're oh, okay. No. But yeah. what I love is just to go into a little cafe, you order a coffee, and they give you these tea biscuits yeah. there with your coffee. So instead of spending all that money to get on a plane to go to Paris, take my word for it, you're not going to get a tea biscuit that is any more authentic. And look at the boxing on this. The packaging is spectacular. Yeah. I love that it's she has French. like very, you know, she's got the yeah. uh, the lavender, the flowers, and yet where she is in LA, that bright yellow that just 
screens happy. The presentation on it is spectacular. You're whether you're giving it all to one or you're going eight different presents out of it, yeah. you're going to leave a mark in someone's heart because yeah. it's going to be a, an you may experience. Have, you may have more than one Valentine. You might. You never know. But you, what's nice about these is that, like I said, they're individually wrapped. Exactly. They're going to stay fresh. Eight weeks. They yeah, say. for a couple of a couple of months. How you're long is have your these? flowers going to last? <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 get, I, I, I was going to say I don't get flowers for that much anymore, but I do give some to my mom. So they're mom loves very them. But you get them, they're good for three, four days. That's exactly. it. Exactly. And then they, kept, they become sad. These are just amazing. And I like that we've got the display by here. By the way, is, I think that was, is that a cinnamon little flavor on that? On the I, red heart. Yeah, yes. that's Isn't a little, amazing. That's the a little bit of a cinnamon flavor. And, and I also love that the quality, you know, how I can tell the quality mm -hmm. too, besides the flavor of them, the printing. Yes. Look at how They're easy, if you guys come in close, look at how perfectly stamped they are. And you can really read it. You can really like read it. Even on the little hearts, yep. sometimes you can't read it because it's off center Precisely. or whatever it is. Precisely. And That's again, brilliant. those will break your teeth. They're not yeah. delicious. This is a culinary well, pure experience. Sugar. <laughs> I mean, she is a she is a world renowned pastry chef, going to one of the finest schools in Paris, going to California to live her dream. These are made in LA. They will not be made until you place your order. So they're made to order and then hand stamped. Again, all quality ingredients: just egg, sugar, flour. Butter. You know, you can read them. You can pronounce yeah. them. You can, I can even say them in French. I know. But uh, they are beautiful. And again, you're giving something to somebody that they're not traditionally getting on Valentine's Day. A lot of times we get chocolate, we get flowers, but to be able to get a real traditional uh, patisserie tea biscuit that melts in your mouth with yeah. all those layers. It's a treat. It is such a treat. Yeah. And again, go ahead. You don't have to give them all at one time. Like, I'm going to give this to you. I love you to the moon and back. Nice. It matches your vest. That How does that make you that. feel? Makes, makes you feel good. Makes you feel See, loved. And that's, and that's going to taste good. Right. Because normally you don't think about giving cookies to somebody for, for, for Valentine's. This is so it's it's not the same old thing. Exactly. The flowers exactly. or this. Or maybe, you know, I'll get you a it's gift a card. New tradition. This is a really beautiful thing and boy if you love your tears you love your coffee oh. and by the way I think Pat we have written into our show our, our coffee um, our coffee we'll talk about that later yeah I'll, I'll bring that up a little bit later but mm. if you want to we can, might even be able to put that on the screen so you can get our hundred pods of coffee mm. um, to go with it these are wonderful with coffee with tea, tea. hot chocolate exactly yeah. and as a caterer I do a lot of tea parties I'm ordering a lot of these just yeah. to have at tea parties because perfect bite this, oh perfect bite yeah. but the, one, one is enough for one person oh. so the thing about about shortbread is and I would tell you that there are there's there's my uh, two rivers hundred count steal those away 42.95 you get you get a hundred pods and you can mix and match them with the cookies but like I said I love the size is perfect because yes. it's just enough but remember these are shortbread you're not you don't sit down a shortbread like you do with chocolate chip cookies mm -hmm. and eat six of them shortbread no. is very rich very and if it's beautiful. made well it's like no other cookie. We, remember, we used to call them, my, my grandmas would make them in, the, in a circle and call them butter balls. Right. And they would sometimes put almonds and things right. like that in them because you put them in your mouth and they just disappear. No. These have that little crisp texture, perfect for dunking. And everybody's gonna get, what do you get? Everybody gets 16 of them. Mm -hmm. And they have the beautiful messages, Deb. And they'll last and last and they'll melt your lover's heart. They'll feel so good. I mean, you're giving something that tastes good, that feels good. And again, it'll yep. last a long time. And it's an impressionable gift yep. because it's not something that everybody always has. Deb, let's step over because we okay. also have single themed biscuits. And if you just wanna go over and show those to everybody. So if you wanna get a box and you like just one of the phrases. Precisely. We have them in, I believe the first one is that which was the, the first I'll one? crumble for you. Okay. That's the one that I gave Lou in the right. hall. So you'll get all the same. Be mine. I this would be one. the perfect one to share, like with your kids. Have it as a candy gram yeah, instead yeah. of a candy gram, a cookie gram for at school. You'll get these in time for Valentine's. And I love you to the moon and back. That's for my mom. That's for my bonus mom. That's for my makeup artist, Julie, for making me look nice. I mean, there, it doesn't have to be a lover. So, you know, so, it can even be for yourself. Yeah. You know, I love me. If like, you're single and you just want to take care of yourself, exactly. you know, people don't do enough of that. We call it self-love. Self-care. Self exactly. Self-love very important. You matter. If you just like it, you enjoy shortbread and you're like, you know what, and I like a cup of coffee or tea in the morning. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're retired and you want to get these. I've got 330 left. That Good is it. Good for you, everyone. And so it's exclusive. It's, and, and as I said, I can tell. T I can tell. The, the quality the is quality spectacular. Ridiculous. And again, when I spent yeah, met crazy. Celine, I mean, she is so such good. a lovely, lovely young lady, mm. and I'm so excited for her mm. passion and her dream. And she did what I've 
always dreamed to do is to go to school in Paris so and much. study pastry or culinary would be everyone's dream come true. And she's just absolutely lovely. And now in LA, she's doing it. Like these are for sale in the most expensive oh, stores. I, I mean, these are a very elite product because the quality is so exceptional is, like and the said, packaging. Yeah, if you went to Paris or you right. went to some, even London, right. tea and oh. biscuits, this is the kind this of stuff, the this, this is what they're recipe. going to give you. Yes. And you're going to remember that forever. And you're going to pay a lot forever. more money for it. Do it at your own house. Yes. For goodness sake. Make Thank being you. at home more special. Thank you, my I dear. I love you, my dear. Love Thank you. Too. Congratulations. So good to see you. Brand new. Love I'm, our new I'm stuff. I'm taking these with me. All right. Going to go over. I'm calling this my best bite. Uh, this is my new best friend since she brought this to me. Uh, the last time we had it on air. Um, Stephanie Roberts is with us. Stephanie is all things kitchen. She knows great food. She brings us a variety of great things. She brings us our emergency preparedness food. Let me just tell you, this is my new favorite. And I will tell you why. I love noodles. I'm not Italian, but I love noodles. But I also don't like carbs. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a kind of keto guy. So I got these home because they gave me samples last week. I have eaten all four bags already, Yay, all right? I Last night, Danny, Danny said, Dad, what are we gonna do for dinner tonight? He said, I'll tell you what, I'm gonna stop at the sushi place, I'm gonna get some satay. Mm -hmm. I took the satay home and chopped it up. I took my noodles out, the peanut flavor. I also got a side of roasted vegetables from the, from the sushi place. Okay. I mixed it all together, and I added a little bit of their peanut sauce too, because I like it a little bit extra peanutty. Sure. Danny and I ate it, and he's like, Dad, this could have come off the menu at that restaurant. And it had noodles with zero carbs. Exactly. Zero carb. And you know what else he said? And, I'm, and then I'll let you go. I know I talk a lot. He said, Dad, these taste exactly like the rice noodles at the restaurant. But they're not rice. You take over. What That's are they? That's right. They are plant fiber. And don't um, let that scare you. <laughs> no. Because they're, they're going so good. to feel exactly like an al dente pasta yeah. in your mouth. So these are keto-friendly meals by Miracle Noodle. And all you are going to do, open a pouch, drain a little water, add the sauce that comes with it, and suddenly you have a meal in minutes that allows you to stick with your healthy eating plan and add any veggies or protein so you want. Good. Or add nothing and just enjoy the sauce and noodles. Is this the first time we've had auto ship too? This is the first right. auto ship and, I think and I we only, sold out last time. I only have like a hundred and something auto ship available on this and don't order all of it because I want to get on auto ship so bad. I My favorite is the peanut. Okay. But they both, they're very, they're, they're similar. One is a little pe more peanutty and one is more traditional Tangy. teriyaki. Tangy, yep. I put fresh, do you mind if I grab some fresh Go peanuts? Go right ahead. Look, remember, peanuts are keto. So I take a little fresh peanut and put it on top like that. And if you want to add a little, whatever it is you want, because you know that's, I, I say that and Stephanie always gets mad at me. But I like, if you want to put a little extra soy sauce or something, whatever you, you like. You can, but you don't, you don't have, have to. to. And that's the difference with these. I know. These are complete I'm a saucy guy. meals. Right, so they are definitely lightly sauce. So here we go. That is a look at the noodles. The noodles come with your S choice of teriyaki. It smells like Japanese restaurant. I know, it it's smells so good. good. I, I, I said before I like the Thai peanut better, but I've been eating more teriyaki, mm. and now I'm all about the teriyaki. <laughs> I love the way those noodles hold together. Last time you would twirl in them, right? It's so good. Like, honestly, you know I'm a foodie. Absolutely. I, I guys, if you don't, maybe don't know me, I was in the restaurant business for like 20 years. I know restaurant food. I know pasta. I ran an Italian restaurant for a long time. And I love, I love Asian food, right? I love rice noodles. They're so good. When you go to that pad thai, rice noodles are like so good. But they're so bad because they're rice <laughs> and they're full of carbs. You look at it. Your carbs for the week in one serving of pad thai. 40 grams of carbs yeah. when you're looking at pasta, when you're looking at things like We're that. We're talking zero carb noodles that taste just like rice noodles. If I'm wrong, I'm not. Trust me. I am not. <laughs> I was going to say I'm not because I know the difference. I mean, we have our, we have our wonderful fiber, uh, our high fiber noodles that we have. Those are fantastic Absolutely. too. Absolutely. Those are a wheat product. And these, these do are... have fiber. So let's yeah. talk about what they are. First of all, when this right. comes to you, it's here's so your pouch. You have a choice of the teriyaki, the Thai peanut, or a combo of three of each. So right. you get six pouches in an order. By the way, this is a lot of food because it's fibrous. And I can't also finish because, it. Yeah, good. I was wondering how I, you did. I can't Last finish. time you said you could, and I, I can't, bet you could. No, I can't finish a whole bag so of this with the noodles. Servings, I've got. I, I have leftovers in a container this big at home yep, from so last night. Yep, so two servings per yeah. bag, six bags, 12 servings and a little math. We are talking less than $3 a serving for less than four net carbs for 
protein, for flavor, for texture, and anything you would ever need. And oh, by the way, then you can add whatever you want to it. So when it gets to you, here's your pouch. You are going to drain the noodles. They come yes. with a little liquid. I didn't the, fir the first time I didn't do that. Well, then you and I learned my me. lesson. Drain okay, the noodles. Okay, but here's something I do want you to do. But. Smell those. They don't smell at all. You know what the ones at the supermarket smell like? That's why we're doing it. Do you want me to turn around and tell you exactly? Yeah. They're, they're, they're like... They're not good. Awful. They're yes. like, they smell like, like a turtle tank. No odor. <laughs> so important you know that. Because a lot yeah. of you have tried different types of keto-friendly noodles, and a lot of them stick. Get these. So absolutely no odor. The texture is wonderful. You don't even have to cook them. Uh, for no. lunch, lunch is my hardest meal of the day. I'm right. always running out and trying to grab something sure. to stay on my healthy eating plan. So now what I'm doing is I'm grabbing a pouch, Maybe I'm throwing the protein, some shrimp, some chicken, chicken some whatever. veggies. Yep. Listen, on a day when I'm running late, I'm not throwing anything in a bowl. But I've got my anchor hawking container. I can pack it ready to go. Then I'm going to bring my pouch of sauce. Yep. Every pouch comes with a pack of noodles and a pack of sauce. So this one's the Thai peanut. A little bit of sesame oil for flavor on top there. We know those oils are always keto friendly. Oh, so there's a the peanut butter. There, and I'll tell you what, there is nothing better than a big lab of peanut oh, butter so with a little good. And that's all. And that's it. all keto friendly. Friendly. Absolutely. So then you can mix that up. Now you can serve this as a cold salad. Yep. You can use it as a, an Asian rice salad or you can heat it up. I'm going to heat this one and turn this into a wonderful stir fry for lunch. But do you see how the noodles, they stay separated. Yes. They yeah. don't glob together. They take on the flavor of whatever you put in it. Yep. So on this one, it's Thai peanut. On the other put one, it's some teriyaki. cilantro on there. You can use your own I'll sauce squ if you want. But if you want an on easy, there. healthy, stick to your eating so plan good. kind of meal, so this good. is how you do it for less than If I can get a 22 year old, my son, who is, who loves Asian food, he loves going to the sushi place, he loves Thai food, he loves Chinese food, right? And I love all those foods too, and maybe you do, but the problem with them is they are so high, a lot of sugar and a lot of carbohydrates. It's really the carbs, they're, because they're all noodle based, almost everything, exactly. or it's in a wrapper, yep. right? This, Processed flour. So if you want to use this as the basis, for whatever it is you want to make, salad, a stir fry, whatever, get some. I told you, I went and I got this restaurant down the street makes wonderful um, satay. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. I just took them off the skewers, I chopped them up, I put them in, and I added roasted veggies. Or sauteed veggies. Well, and look what we've and done here. And that's exactly here. What, what you I mean, what look at those here. beans, some beef, but your base is a noodle. Now, if you're not familiar with Miracle Noodles, you're probably thinking, so what is it if it isn't pasta and it isn't flour? It is 97% water and 3% plant fiber. So this actually goes all the way it's back to Japan. It's not seaweed. It is not seaweed. It's, it's actually called the konjac plant. Yeah. So what the konjac plant is, is a plant that grows uh, in the marshy seas. In Japan, they've been eating this for some 1,400 years. This yeah. is not a new concept to no. eat this plant fiber. It's just new to the U.S. So Miracle Noodle it's figured out how to get the scent away, made the texture perfectly lovely. And look at Then they've added these sauces. I wanted to, to show everybody how it holds. Changer. And this is important, all right, because when you buy, like you try to buy healthy noodles, right. you have to cook it exactly because otherwise it breaks apart. And it gets all mushy, right? typically. This noodle is like a regular pasta noodle. you, you got to pull away so you can see I'm stretching it, guys. So see how it actually is stretchy and it won't break? Now, it's too, so when you bite it, it breaks. Absolutely. But I, and, and I just pulled it a little too hard, but that's, that's important because that's what gives you that integrity to the noodle. Because you want a noodle, you want to be able to taste the, sh the shape of the noodle when you're eating it. You want it to when you're feel like pasta it. in your mouth. Exactly. Or else it's mushy. Too yeah. many of the uh, noodle replacements, if you will, have a mushy texture. Or they they don't feel like pasta. Uh, or they smell. And so we've gotten all those problems solved, and we're making it so you can literally grab and go with sauce. Mm. This could be my lunch for the next two days, because that's more than I'm going to eat for lunch. Two servings in every pouch. Six pouches in an order. Let me show you. So, honestly, this is a, each pouch is a meal and a half. Because and for me, and I'm a big guy, I weigh, what, 220 pounds. I, you think I could suck three of these things down? And I was sitting with Danny last night. I'm like, dude, I can't finish something. You want something? He's like, no, I'm full too. We, we could not finish each having a bag of these. So you're getting six meals for $34.99, more like nine meals. I would say for the average retired person, you guys could probably split this. If you're going to add a protein, you're going to add veggies. But you get... We're doing a, how are we doing the, the, the offer? Are we doing 
Either or? Yep, either or so, or, or a the combo. combo. Yes. So what I would recommend first time buyers, get some teriyaki and get some peanut. You'll get three bags of each. The nutritional information is right on the back. Um, it talk, talks to you about your carbohydrates versus your fiber. Do you know that if you eat this, this whole thing, if you ate the whole thing, Six minus two is four. Eight carbs. Uh huh. That's the whole, the whole bag, which I challenge now, you to. Let me tell you what a cup of regular pasta is. A cup of regular pasta is going to be about 40 carbs, okay? Cheryl will tell me if I'm wrong. She knows Cheryl's coming That's up. She's, exactly she's my right. keto queen over there. If you did a cup of rice, you know, that's, that could be 50 carbs, okay? Depending on what you're putting in there. This is eight carbs for the whole bag. So if you split it, it's four carbs net. And then you could put whatever you want in there. You could make salads out of it. You could make stir fry out of it. You could, I mean, you, honestly, whatever kind of meal. I love, and I love the sauce. The Asian sauce is the delicious. The sauces are wonderful. Yeah. So these are coming to you cooked, which means when you're thinking grab and go, easy weeknight meals, you can make a salad out of it. You can make a stir fry out of it. I, lots of times I add the already cooked and cut chicken yeah. from the grocery store. Easy. So all I'm doing is dumping in the pan, buy the pre-cut vegetables, yeah. whatever it takes hey, to Pat. give you a your healthy eating plan. How are we doing on the auto shift? Do we have any of that left? Oh, he said there's a few dozen left in auto ship if you want to get either the flavors or the combo. I like the peanut, so if you want to go peanut, you can't go wrong with that. If you're a teriyaki person, go there, but get both with the combo. All right, 093286, thank you for cooking. I've so started good. eating the peanuts, so this is Dude, what this I'm stuff doing. this will not go to waste. We'll be eating all this stuff. When we come back, Valentine's Day is just, what, two and a half weeks away? Wait till you see the cake we have. Oh, my gosh, beautiful. <laughs> HSN is bringing you one of our biggest Tucson gem events ever. Discover jewelry treasures from around the globe without leaving your living room, including mine finds from Jay King, gemstone jewelry from Colleen Lopez, and more. It's a gem-filled week you won't want to miss. With special guests joining us from Tucson on Tuesday, February 6th. The Tucson gem event starts Monday through February 6th. cool stuff going on over there up to 50 percent off storage and organization on hsn.com so if you need ways to get your stuff put away after the holidays if you're looking like you can't beat origami you got a storage place and you want to organize it check it all out on hsn.com we have literally hundreds of different ways that you can get things safe and secure and stored properly all right i've been looking forward to this all day my absolute favorite cake on the planet. Did you know that? My favorite cake no, is red I, velvet. I was going to say, I'm actually going to fight you for that because red velvet is my absolute favorite Is it really? Favorite cake I, I, first of all, I got the, remember the Christmas cake that I bought? Yeah. It was so good. The so one that was green. Right? And, oh my gosh. This, yeah, this is our Valentine's. We both wore red. This is our Valentine's red velvet cake. Um, all about love today. It is all about love. And I, the size of it, it's oh a lot gosh. bigger than I thought it was going to be. 10 inches. It's a 10 inch cake. It is a four triple, pounds. yeah, triple layer cake, four pounds. It's going to come to you frozen and all you need to do is thaw and eat. If you want, you can cut chunks out of it and keep the rest in the freezer. Yeah. But there is, there is an art form to a good red velvet cake and oh, David's cookies has impressed us for years and they're doing it again. All detailed by hand. Look at how beautiful and moist. Oh my gosh, these, I'm telling you, the, this is the oh, cake man. you want. And it doesn't have to be just for Valentine's Day. This could be for someone's birthday at any time of the year. An anniversary, if you want to surprise your loved one with the perfect oh, the like smell. gift of love yeah. is the perfect red velvet cake. But these are handmade, hand decorated at David's Bakery. They're coming directly to your home from David's Bakery. They're gonna come frozen. I wanna show you how they're coming so that you can see. But you've got three delicious, moist, decadent layers of that perfect red velvet made from oh cocoa powder. So you are getting that nice, rich, decadent, chocolatey flavor. But let's talk about what's in between those layers. That delicious, made from scratch, mm perfectly tangy cream cheese Best. frosting. And I'm telling you, this is creamy butter, cream cheese, pure vanilla made from scratch in between all of those moist, delicious red velvet layers. It's not too sweet. It gives you that perfect tang that really mirrors. <laughs> 
You just, just shovel, shovel it over. It in. But they marry together so well. Mm. That tangy cream cheese, that nice decadent, rich, chocolatey. Wow. But I want, let me show you how it's coming to your door. Okay. So. They're not made yet. They're coming fresh to your door right. from David's, directly from David's Bakery. Hand decorated, handmade, hand decorated in this box. And you can see, look how perfect that is. They're collared around the outside to really protect it. So it's gonna come perfect to your door. They're all frozen. So when you receive and you welcome this just box of love to your home, stick it in your freezer. When you're ready to use it, all you're gonna do is bring it out the, either the night before or the morning of Valentine's Day, Valentine's Day, anniversary, whatever it is, bring it out the morning of or the night before, put it in your fridge, let it thaw. It's unsliced, you can cut the big steakhouse slices, you can cut smaller slices, whatever you want to do, and anything you do not use, Put uh, some uh, plastic wrap around it and yeah. pop it back in your freezer yeah. and save it cut, for later. So cut you out can, what you need. Yeah, cut what yeah. you need and you can refreeze this for later. But it really is like this is the this, ultimate. Yeah, and oh this cake God. would probably, these are really big pieces of cake. Um, you could probably get. 14, 16 slices out of this cake very, very easily. If you do four ounce slices, yeah. you can feed 16 people 16 four ounce slices. And, I, uh, and, and by the way, it's funny because I, I found out about red velvet cakes when I was, I was dating this girl from Tennessee and it's a big deal down there, right? Red velvet cakes are mm -hmm. everywhere. And I was like, once I had one, I was like, that's my favorite cake of all time. Oh my gosh. Because it's actually a chocolate cake. Yep. But they make it red, right? And then they put that cream cheese frosting on it. It's unbelievable. In fact, one of our producers here, Jared, his mom makes oh, a great red velvet cake. Frosting. She's made me one. <gasps> and this is like that. I mean, and, and then the crumbs on the side, it's classic it's, red velvet. It's classic red velvet. So this is exactly how it's gonna look when you pull it out. Yeah, Valentine's okay. Day, ladies, grab Get a this. glass of wine. You've got the uh, decorated, not only inside that made from scratch, cream cheese frosting, but decorated all on the outside. Love, like I said, Valentine's anniversary, anything. The red velvet crumbles on the side, which helps also the cake to maintain its integrity. Yeah. So when you pull it out of that perfectly sealed box, it's gonna look beautiful. But then check this out, Guy. Yeah. Look at this. Your friends are gonna see this right here when, you, when, when they get your cake, and then you open it up, you cut into it, yeah, it's got and those, those delicious oh my layers, and all of that tangy cream cheese frosting, that delicious decadent, oh my, it's just so good. We don't have a lot of these to go around, but I, I wanted to remind everybody, because Pat just told me, my producer, that we do have two ship dates. You can order it right now, and it'll come frozen. You can pop it in the freezer, but we also have a delayed order where you said February 9th is when it will, when it will show up. It ships like the 30th of the month and then it shows up on like uh, by the 9th. So you'll get it like, you know, a few days, five, six days before, before um, Valentine's Day. And let me tell you this too. I have actually never made a red velvet cake. I'm not really a baker. Right. I can do anything in a fry pan. I can do anything in the oven. I can, do, I can smoke things out on the barbecue. Baking is a very precise, concise it is. thing. It's and I don't have a little bit of chemistry. I don't have the patience for it. <laughs> I'm not, the, I'm not, not that I'm that's impatient. Okay. I just, you have to really take your time. And that, that's what, when you, the folks at David's who have perfected this with their cookies oh for years and years and years, they have created the perfect cake. And that's that perfect point. And I will tell you this too. And I think you will agree. Mm -hmm. This is not an overly sweet cake. No. Not no, at no, all. No, no. Because the frosting is not killer sweet. It's not. It's it's actually more tangy. So if you yeah. know, if, if you cream love cheese. cream cheese yeah. frosting and you know good cream cheese frosting, you know you want a little, you want more tang than you want that sweet. And this is that perfect mm. amount of tang mm. to balance so beautifully with that nice, rich, That's decadent um, chocolate in there. So it's made from cocoa powder. This is actually, like you said, a chocolate cake. Yeah. It's just red, that red velvet with that delicious cream oh. cheese frosting. But what I love about it is, like you said, if you're not a baker at home or you're just trying to think of something for Valentine's, Galentine's Day, an anniversary, just a perfect gift for someone, something perfect to have in your home. Yeah. You don't have to do any work. David's is going to make this they're gonna make this handmade, hand decorated. There's not a machine that these are going down a conveyor belt, a machine nope. is doing it. They're, they're doing these by hand. And all of this delicious, tangy cream cheese frosting is made from scratch. And, yeah. So beautiful, delivered fresh to your door, Amy, this ready is, to go. You would never make this for yourself at oh, home. Oh no. And that's the thing, it's a, this is an indulgence. This is something that's a special treat for you. Mm. Maybe all you, you know, you're like, you know what? I don't wanna go out to dinner. I'm gonna grab a couple of steaks for me and my, my partner. I wanna grab a good bottle of wine. I don't wanna have to make dessert. What a perfect so way good. to end your meal. Yes. Then to have this, and remember, 
you can ha you'll have this thing you store it in the freezer for months you can so store for you up can to 12 it, months yeah anytime you want to pull out a slice anytime you want to pull that slice so yeah. it is coming completely frozen to your door but baked fresh it hasn't been sitting in a warehouse somewhere right. It's coming baked fresh, frozen to your door. Stick it right in your freezer. Pull it out the day before, um, the night before, the morning of. Let it thaw. Cut whatever size slices you want, whether you want those steakhouse slices or it feeds up to 16 four ounce slices. Anything you don't use, pop it back in your yeah. freezer. So you can save it for later. So if you say maybe you have a tradition with your girlfriends, every Friday night they come over or every Sunday night or every Wednesday, whatever it is, you've got something delicious right. in your freezer that not only is absolutely gorgeous, absolutely delicious, and a talking point, but something they're not going to go out and get anywhere right. else. And it says love, which doesn't necessarily have to be Valentine's. It, it could doesn't. be your girlfriends. It could be your buddy, yes. right? I mean, you could just be grandma, whatever. Look what I brought yeah. for you. And you said free shipping. Free shipping. Yeah. So maybe and you have Amy, a family member or someone with an anniversary coming up. It's Let perfect. HSN send it to their home for them. Here's the thing. Fifty nine ninety nine is is a steal for this cake. Mm -hmm. I there was a fair a bakery back in my hometown. It's called Devore's Bakery. And if you went in and bought like a, a, a homemade birthday cake like that, back then, and I'm talking years and years right. and years ago, you'd spend fifty bucks on a cake. Right. Nowadays, to get something of this quality for fifty nine ninety nine, oh that you goodness. don't have to. All you have to do is take it out. That's it. And thaw it and cut it. And you've got instant beautiful cake. If you know somebody that, oh, somebody that maybe has a birthday around Valentine's Day, be perfect yes. as a birthday cake. If this is a perfect yeah. gift for you, for your friends, for a family member with an anniversary, for Valentine's Day, whatever it is. This is something special. When I say special, special. The decadent red velvet, just that chocolatey, the tangy cream cheese. Man. Something special you cannot just go out and get anywhere. You, know you can have delivered to your door or delivered to a loved one's door. You know what store. red velvet cake is? It's sexy. Oh! Red velvet cake. I mean, it is. It's red. It is. It's yummy. It's just, Especially yeah. when I eat the whole piece. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and don't feel bad about it. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> you, will, you will absolutely love it. If you want to grab it, the item number is 075313. We only have a handful of these, so if you want to uh, grab it, my producer Pat just said they're going to go, um, go ahead and order it, or at least write down the order number. Just remember, you have two different ship uh, dates. So good. Thank you, Amy, Amy. Thank wonderful. you, Wonderful. Appreciate you. You're welcome. Sweet, sweet, wonderful sweater you're wearing. Thank Look at you. you. You've got the headband. <laughs> I'm all about Are the love today. Are those hearts on the headband, too? Hearts on the headband. Hearts on the headband. All right, thank you, my dear. Thank you, guys. Hey, uh, you can be the first to know when your favorite brands are on air. You can customize your shopping experience today by signing up what we call for, uh, we call it our when to watch emails. Signing up is easy. All you gotta do is go to HSN account, go to your account, update your communication preference, and select your favorite brands. We've got over 350 to choose from, so it's called when to watch reminders. So make sure you check that out. All right, last item of the show. I get to be with my friend Cheryl. Aww. Hi, Cheryl Boyle. Hi. How are you? Doing wonderful. How are you? So, Cheryl, I, I like to call Cheryl our health and wellness, lifestyle, everything, <laughs> wonderful, beautiful expert. Um, you, you've been, yeah, but you've been with with all the shakes, with all the machines to help us to, to, to have lead a healthier lifestyle. Yeah. Problem is, healthy lifestyles are not easy sometimes, they are not. right? Especially with, with food. That's why I bring a lot of different mixes to our to our shows. But there are some things that you are just not willing to give up. That's right. And one of those things in my world, especially on Halloween, is the classic peanut butter cup. <laughs> and you all know the one I'm talking about, which is just incredible chocolate, incredible peanut butter. It's really not a very complicated recipe. Unfortunately, the ones that are there are absolutely inundated with sugar. And literally, you get enough sugar for the day in one peanut butter cup. We are offering our no sugar, comp our no sugar keto company 60 count peanut butter cups and I will tell you, I would challenge anybody to know the difference. <laughs> they don't. In fact, I think they're every bit as good, maybe even better. I the fact that. that they have no sugar is crazy. I don't understand that, but they use the best peanut butter. Now, we do have a couple yeah. of different flavors. I always talk about the peanut butter because Cheryl and I know how much I like peanut butter. I do too. We also have the one that's like the chocolate mint. The, exactly. With the mint inside. Yep. And then we have one that's all fudge. Correct. Now, you can get, I always get confused. You get 60 of them. You do. All right? You can get... You can get, go ahead, Cheryl. You Five do boxes of the of 12 of the peanut butter. And those will sell out first. Right. Or you can get five boxes of 12 of the mint. You get a lot for that money. Or you get two boxes of 30 for the, for the fudge brownie, or you get the combo. Okay. Which means you get 15, 15, 30. 15, 15, 30. All right. 
The most, the, the most popular always seems to be the peanut butter, but I will tell you, it's the ingredients that they put in here, and it's that texture. They use really, you guys use really, really, really good ingredients. Um, and, and you don't even, you don't miss the sugar at Not all because at all. it's still sweet. That peanut butter is ooey gooey. The mint is ooey gooey. I mean, you made me a shake, and I think you're going to do oh, it I'm again. Oh, I'm going to make it again. You know I'm your best friend. <laughs> she knows how much I love her when she does you it. You have protein and but, goodness. I mean, to get 60 of these, you, I mean, and to be able to indulge anytime you want, um, lower, way lower calories, um, lower in fat, and again, your carbohydrates, because there's four One grams of carb. fiber. One carb. One net carb. I wonder how many in a regular peanut butter cup. Oh gosh, I can't even imagine. It's gotta be at least it's gotta be at least fifteen to twenty. Uh, I, I can't even imagine. So it's, have twenty of these or one of those. Right, exactly. Yeah. So you have seventy calories, one net carb, zero sugar, all of the goodness, nothing gets sacrificed, gluten free, but the taste, the taste is what draws us back over and over again. Mm. Now we do use mm. coconut oil and he was talking about the high quality ingredients. Mm. That coconut oil is what makes it so creamy and so scrumptious and so delicious and it gives you that beautiful mouthfeel. Yeah. And you're not gonna chase the sugar. So you're gonna get those wonderful healthy fats from the coconut oil, but only 70 calories. One net carb, zero sugar, keto friendly. And this doesn't mean you have to be keto. We've talked about this a lot, but if you're new to the no sugar brand, it's just a better wow. choice. They're delicious, they're scrumptious. I even love repurposing them. I'm gonna make it into a shake. But you know what I did this weekend? I took the peanut butter cup and I chopped them up into little morsels and I made keto cookies. So I rolled them into an almond flour dough and I put, they melt and they're ooey and they're gooey. I don't and see any out here. The, I know, because I ate them all. You I, my brain was like, I'm gonna bring these, I'm gonna bring these. Well, well, don't make them on a Saturday and come in on a Tuesday. No, you get 60 of them, so you can incorporate them into all kinds of other recipes if you want. I love that idea. You could actually take them and you could incorporate them and you can make brownies or whatever. I made muffins almond yeah, you with can the do all double that stuff. fudge. Yeah, they're amazing. 60 of these at $34.95 means you could take these to work. Now, they all come individually wrapped. Yes. Which is important. And you can see whether you get the mint or the peanut butter or the fudge. The fudge is in the purple wrap, the peanut butter is in the orange, and then the green is it's the one for the mint. mint. Yep. If you love... There's a famous candy. Uh, and it's, My father's favorite. It, well, I used to put... I, one that I like this was Andy's. <laughs> and they're great. They're great. Great candy, yeah, and they and they are a mint type candy, and I used to put them on checks um, with their foil when I used to be in the restaurant business, and people would love them. But when you when you open these up, these are these are bigger. You can see that's that is all that mint inside. Okay, I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna. Where's a peanut butter? Oh here. You oh, peanut butter one. We ate them all. I put them in the smoothie. Oh, you put them in the smoothie. <laughs> so here's a peanut butter, and what I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna cut it. It's a little bit easier to cut. And then I'm going to take it, and well, she's making me a shake over here. I so, know, so I know. Now, the peanut butter, I don't know how close you can get, is very ooey. Yummy and goodness. Gooey. The peanut butter really is what makes this cookie so know, good. I All right, I love the chocolate, but the peanut <laughs> butter that's inside is, I think it's, it tastes better than the peanut butter, because the peanut butter in the regular cup is chalky. It is chalky. And this, this one is, tastes peanutty. It does. It tastes like that natural peanut butter that yeah. you have to use in the machine when you go to those health food stores. But it's, it's sweet. It's, it is sweet. Okay, and let's talk about that. I think a lot of times when you tell people that it has no sugar, it, we actually use erythritol. So it's, it's found naturally in grapes, pears, and watermelons. And that's what I used in my, all of my baking. It's my favorite sweetener. So when I made the cookies, yeah. when I make muffins, I add... I put in my coffee. Exactly. I do not notice the difference. You don't notice the difference. And I love that we put it in... If Peanut you have, butter shake. Okay, so I did our keto bomb shake yeah. in vanilla with peanut butter cups. So you're getting delicious peanut butter flavored smoothie. That's so good. How about that meal? Man, you're, you're good, I'm telling you. The last time, what'd you do? I didn't think you did I the still, fudge brownie last time, I can't remember. This, this, this is, is so good. If you're a peanut butter person, this is, this is basically a no brainer. But I love them all. You don't have to suffer. It, it, it is exactly, you know, the truth is out cheap. What, you may not know about this, I, don't, I rarely ever suffer. I, I, <laughs> As I got older, I'm like, club. you know what? I suffered enough as a kid. I was worked in the <laughs> restaurant business 80 hours a week, worked the worst schedule. I did all that. That's and I'm so like, good. as I got older, I'm like, I want to stay fit. Mm. You know, I want to be like Cheryl, right? I want to stay fit. <laughs> but I don't want to suffer. And I don't, I don't, I'm not willing to make like certain sacrifices. 
Right. I don't feel like I'm sacrificing. Zero. Whether it's this or the red chocolate or those miracle noodles, I see, and what I'll do, like Cheryl just did, I will use some of the ingredients and I'll make other things out of them. Exactly. Like I will take the cups and I'll make a shake or I will use them to crumble on something, right? You can make muffins with these as well. If you cookies. want to use them, cookies, all Top that your stuff. your ice cream. We are very busy. It's $34.95. Look at all you get. You get five 60, boxes. 60 cups. Crazy. I mean, 60 cups, if you really break that down, like 60 cups, I'm telling you, I know you think that sounds like a lot, and it is a lot, but you will eat them. They're so delicious. Yeah. Now, I will say, because of the coconut oil, chances are you're going to have one, you're, you're going to be totally satiated. Oh, you're you not, only need one. You only need the one. Yeah. So trust me, keep them with you everywhere. Have them in your purse, have them in your handbag. You're going to absolutely time. love that. It's the best quality chocolate, and the fillings are delicious. If you like frozen yogurt, and you're trying to eat, you know, maybe eat your frozen, uh, uh, your, your ice creams and things like that a little lighter without the sugar, you can use this on top of it as a topping for any of that stuff. You can dress up whatever you want. Three, uh, so the choices are all five in peanut butter. I'm learning now. Yeah. All five in the, <laughs> in the fudge and the mint. Are all five in the... The fudge brownie. Fudge brownie. Or we'll give you a box of the fudge brownie, and then you get a half and half box of the mint and the peanut butter. Did Correct. I get it right that you time? did. Yes. And I mean that's a great option. But if you know and your favorite, size. okay. So the peanut butter is like your favorite peanut butter cup, but better because yeah. the peanut butter is better in my opinion. And you have the zero sugar and the 70 yeah. uh, calories. The mint is. I grew up on these mint. Now my father is his favorite is the mint. This is a great Ooh, thing. I actually it sent minty. It, it sent him those for Valentine's Day because mm -hmm. he can't have sugar anymore. The doctors have told him he's got to cut sugar, refined sugar out of his diet. So I sent him these. He loved them. He was so happy with that gift. It's just, again, it could be you just want to pull. Marks in there? <laughs> you could be just wanting to pull some That's, sugar out okay. of your diet. And then where's the, is this the fudge? That's the fudge. I, I, you know what's funny? I don't know if, I think I've tried the fudge. I'll try it again. It's like a dark chocolate truffle. Now, I love throwing one in my, in my coffee in the morning. The beer so chocolate you've got a freak. mocha coffee. This is really good. It's so good. Now, because of that deep, dark, rich flavor of the fudge. It's like brownies. I know. But, but, but when you like <laughs> mush them down and you get that like. Tastes like brownies. That really thick brownie goodness. Yeah, that's look. what that tastes like to me. I think I'll use a little. And that's why I say it tastes like a dark chocolate see, truffle. This is, this is actually. That's the mushy brownie. We'll see if we can get the shot. I'm, I'm, that's I'm the only way I can do you. is with this knife. I'm telling so you. So you can see, see on the inside, it's actually <laughs> like softer on the inside like the other two. The outside is a little bit. It's so good. Please I'm don't. Not, I'm not going to cut myself. Okay. So that, that's the fudgy part. I it, would. it tastes like a brownie. It's so good. It does taste like that's a brownie. That's my second favorite. And that's why I say when you chop these up, you can use them. I like them. the mint. It's just I'm not. A, that's not that's my thing. That's okay. You're not. A, you're not. Yeah. That's not your thing. But I love the mint. I love it on type on top of ice cream, not to mm. add the extra guilt. I love mm. chopping it up. But the fudge, I think, goes great if you're making chocolate chip cookies. You want yeah. them to be keto. Use that. Chop it up instead right. of the morsels you get at the grocery store that have that aftertaste. These do not. And these are made better because the bags of morsels that you're buying. Have you ever opened up a bag of morsels and they have like a sh like a frosted look to them? Like a film. That's because the the, the butterfat has come to the surface. I mean, sitting in a bag forever, all right? Correct. These are gonna come to you fresh made. Each one is individually wrapped. We are extremely busy. I knew we were, every time Cheryl comes out with these, we're like, oh, people love the cups. They're so good. I think, you know, too, Cheryl, it's also the convenience of them because a lot of us out there, a lot of us still work, and we wanna have a sweet treat in the afternoon, but we don't wanna feel bad about it, you know? Which is why a lot of people, they go to the coffee shop. Because they think, okay, I'll have a coffee, but then you're loading yourself up with caffeine and Tell everything me. else, and you're paying, and you, you pay and five sugar or six if you bucks, like one of those fruit and coffees. sugar, right? Whereas, if you don't have time for that, you can sit at your desk and you can pop one of these things out, or if you're home, and you're like. You know what it is when you just want to have chocolate. It's like yeah. with, the, with the red chocolate that we had earlier. And it's, this is, you know, one or the other, right? You can get them both. They're, they're, these are different because these have different fillings. Right. And, and, but again, same type of deal. Anytime you look at that creamy peanut it's butter. It's so good. It's so good. Give me that. And I love that you talked about, I mm. love that you talked about mm. they're individually wrapped. And because yeah. I'm always, we've talked about this, like at a, at a stoplight or driving, I'm always reaching for them yeah. in my handbag. They're just great just to have a choice on you, a better choice. Yeah. It, over time, it makes a huge difference. So wherever you're at, maybe you're trying to cut some calories, maybe you're trying to cut some sugar, but the point is, you're not going to miss it. It's a better choice that tastes better than the real refined sugar one, it's yeah. just a better choice, period. Yeah, and listen, 
neither one of us are telling you what we're not going to try to tell you what to do. No, if you want to hey, you want to go ever have one of those peanut butter cups, that's fine. The problem is you know after you eat it, you're going to be like, dang, I shouldn't eat that thing. And you're going to want or another I one. I should have had the second one. Right? You're going to want another one because you're going to chase the sugar. That's, why does it do that? You're not going to chase. You need to teach me these I things. I get it. See, that's, that is it. <laughs> it's, it's, like, it's like jumping in. Once you jump in, and not only that, when you eat these, you don't, like I said, you don't feel bad after you eat them. You say, you know no. what, I'm making a conscious choice. You Nine out of ten times, if you eat something you shouldn't, you're always like, dang, I shouldn't eat that. I know, no. and then you're like, oh, oh you I get don't get that. Feel because sugar is feeds disease. Well, we know and that. it makes everything grow. I know. Yeah. Mm. And there is Thank balance, you. though, but this is a really good choice. Do you know that? No sugar keto Isn't that funny? I'll say this real quick. The one, the, one of the best things I noticed about cutting back on almost all the sugar in my life, digestively, I'm so much healthier. Oh, yeah. Oh, it, it, I like it's completely. a game. I won't get into all the details. The inflammation. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Man. I know. I know. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed our show, everybody. I love you all, my Facebook friends. I'm sorry we went by so quick. Um, but, uh, you know, the shows go by quick. We've got a quick buy for you, but you can check out everything that we have available on hsm.com. All of our chocolates, all of our wonderful things. I know the amazing Lynn Murphy. You can come back. Lynn Murphy, uh, she's coming up next. I love my Lenny. Uh, and then I am off, what, the next couple days, but I'll see you guys on Friday. Here's a little bit of that quick buy, and stay tuned for Lynn.